Dave Oliver is chairman of the Taekwondo Association of Great Britain. key element for me in destruction is that you've got the confidence to hit it and penetrate and go through it and that is just psyching yourself up you're really using your adrenaline as you would do if you were in a self-defense situation on the street <laughs> is very difficult because it's, it's a mental thing uh, as much as a physical thing. If you're scared of uh, hitting the object, then you're not going to penetrate, you're not going to go through, and you'll end up injuring yourself. Does being tough in the dojo lead to acting tough outside? In common with most martial arts instructors, Dave sees how training can change his students. What I find with students when they start training, a lot of them do come and think that they're going to be Bruce Lee or Jean Claude Van Damme and want to fight. It actually has the opposite effect on them because when they spar or do destruction or do patterns and they work out regular, it takes the aggression away. They don't really need to do that. They can go in competitions and they can spar in the school. I don't know that many people who are aggressive who are really good martial artists.